I'm Kit Doe here in Sunnyvale with an only in Silicon Valley coronavirus story. The folks here at Bloom Energy earlier this week were trying to figure out how they could help out with this nationwide shortage in ventilators. That's when one of their engineers downloaded a service manual to a ventilator and then taught himself how to fix them in about a day. This is actually something he enjoyed. This is this is fun for him. Bloom Energy COO Susan Brennan then assembled a handful of engineers into a small and nimble group known as a tiger team. That team scaled up quickly with engineers from across the company cleaning, repairing, and testing old ventilators. Bloom, by the way, makes high-tech fuel cells. In a matter of days, their engineers had turned around 49 of them. It's caught the eye of you-know-who. Bloom Energy, these folks deserve recognition. Uh, they are converting now about 30 a day uh, of our ventilators. Talk about repurposing a manufacturing plant to meet this moment. Word got out and 150 more ventilators just showed up this week. Bloom wants anyone in the country who might have an old ventilator to contact them and send it on in. We're not doing this to to make money. We're doing this because we saw a need and because that's the DNA that's our culture and we have you know we have a lot of moxie. We are highly confident. We knew we could do this. You know, it was in the art of the possible. And as long as it's in the art of the possible, you can figure out how to get something done. In Sunnyvale, Kit Doe, KPIX5.